With the 1942 model year started the second generation of the 62 Cadillac. These cars were again the design work of famous GM designer Harley Earl. Welcome to a new episode of the Classic Car Zone video series. So let's right jump in. We cover here the second generation of the 62s. Cars were produced for the model years 1942, 1946 and 1947. They are considered true classics nowadays and many car enthusiasts are very happy to own one, or more. In general, there were three body styles available, a two-door coupe, a four-door sedan and a two-door convertible. The cars can be distinguished from the previous years by their more massive grille. Front fender character outlines now extended into the front doors. The rear fender extended into the rear door. As a kind of exception, our next car is a Series 63 from 1942. 63s were available in 1941 and 42 and only produced as sedans, similar to the 61 and 62 styling. They had a different trunk compared to 62s. This car shown here features the typical interior color in various shades of beige and brown. The instrument cluster is Art Deco styling at its best. Contrasting the butterscotch color steering wheel and a beige dashboard. The inner door panel has a squared pattern with buttons. The luxurious rear of a 1942 car. Note the central armrest in the ashtrays on the opposing side of the seat. A beige carpet and holder straps complete the interior. As a matter of fact, when production at Cadillac was resumed in fall of 1945, in the beginning only 62 models were produced. Our first car from this year is a blue example with black top. In this side view we can see the wonderful sleek lines and very proportional build of this model. Automobile production design had definitely reached new heights. From the tag we see color code 121, named same blue by Cadillac. The top was operated by hydraulic cylinders, using brake fluid. The system works well. Unfortunately, neglected systems attract water which leads to rust and finally leakage. Here we see that the door panel design has changed slightly from 1942. Lines replace the square pattern. The engine is the same like in the 1942 model year, a 346-inch 3 mono block V8. A robust machine and long living. They run smoothly, need little maintenance and fail rarely. I only could find few 1946-62 Cadillacs in desperate shape. This example is one of them, a torpedo-style coupe. It has been sitting outside and hasn't been driven for a long time. The interior has deteriorated badly, and the engine is probably frozen. It looks pretty complete though. This convertible has the tan top version and is in great shape. Here are a few vintage photos featuring the 1946 Cadillac 62. This factory photo shows the first Cadillac leaving the assembly line in October of 1945. I couldn't find out the names of the people shown in this photo. They were probably the responsible managers. Another factory photo, showing a long line of cars. They are almost finished, just the bumpers missing. The 1947 models have only minor styling changes compared to 46. There were also hydroelectric window lifts on the Series 62 convertible installed. These convertibles remained the sole ragtop in Cadillac's lineup. Polished metal stone guards on the fenders replaced the rubber ones used on 1946 models. Interesting enough, this replacement happened at Oldsmobile a year later, in 1948. The Series 62's remained Cadillac's bread and butter lineup with 40,000 produced. That were 84% of the makes total volume for 1947. Shown from many angles, this 1947 maroon convertible with tan top is in flawless shape. This 1947 four-door sedan has been sitting in a forest in Minnesota for many years. 
Our next car is a flawless two-tone 1947 coupe. All the details are correct. Such cars are valuable like blue stock. As we have seen before in a 1942 model, also this car has the multiple shades of brown and beige interior. This car is a true 1947 barn fine Cadillac. The four-door sedan was probably repainted in black. that this car has probably been beige before. With a snapshot of a 62 model from the 1949 noir movie Dangerous Profession, starring George Raft and Ella Rains, we have reached the end of our overview about the second generation of 62 Cadillacs. Thank you for watching and subscribing. More original classic cars and information you find at ClassicCarsZone.org